what's happening here we go again still see a storm and uh over here i remember this dealership for a long time past it's been quite a few things so if you remember anything about it, you got any stories make sure you leave your comment right off of route 12 As you can see, it's kind of fallen by the wayside. It's a nice looking building. It's been here for a long time. I remember it as a, as a kid and a teenager and as an adult. It used to be a nice car dealership. It's changed hands a few times. Not quite sure what it was, the original one, but I will look it up, see if I can't find out the information. If you know anything, make sure you uh, give me that info on it. You ever bought a car here or you ever had work done here? Then this is, uh, yeah, I remember, I remember this place very well, actually. Remember, there used to be a lot of nice cars sitting out here. Well, it's another urban wreck that's uh, fallen by the wayside. There's what it looks like now. Can't see if we can't get access to it. I'm going to walk around the building, take a look, see, go through the windows. Sometimes don't need to really get in there, you know, just take a look and see what's happening and what's left property is for sale so I want to start a car dealership or something else here it is let's see what we got here well yeah I've never really dealt, dealt with these people in here I see the lights are on see the lights so that means obviously that uh, the property still Look fairly maintained. I hear a peep, peep, peep. That's a good thing, right? I don't need to get inside there. Let's just take a look and see what's happening now. The old service station. A lot of bay doors. It used to be a pretty popping place at one point in time. Now it's not. Same old SOS. This one, though, doesn't have a lot of litter around it. Put my glasses up here. Where's your bay? Sorry, I'm trying to get the best view for you guys I can. As far as not going in there, just getting a shot through the windows and stuff. Looks like it's starting to have a little structural... Uh, issues here I see bricks are starting to fall out right there doesn't look too bad though a little patchwork to fix that up the old cones oh service uh, station here back of it's all grown over JRM auto repair it's been some way before then but we recommend we recommend DuPont Automotive Finishes, the official finish of NASCAR. Oh wow, it's huge in there. I don't know if it's gonna come out on film, but it's huge in there, man. Spider is in a broken window or something, but. Sometimes, you know, it's a nice thing that there's not no broken windows. I'm going to walk around the building and just kind of take a look at it. There's street view, the old parking lot. As you can see, there was a lot of parking out here. And I can remember it being where there was a lot of uh, cars out here. I remember coming by here and seeing some really nice cars here and there. Back gate's open. I hear uh, something running over here. Hear it? I guess that's the security lights. Okay, there's cars in there. Oh, I did not know that. So this is for <laughs> there's cars in there. All right, let's go to see if we can get a better look at that. All right, here's the side of the building. I'm trying to find us a window where we can look in really good. Back lot. I'm surprised there's not garbage dump back here. 
building is huge. I mean, it is. It's huge. Well, I don't know what I'm walking into now. I see, you can see there's cars parked out here. So you can't take a look inside. Well, it's got electricity, so obviously somebody's paying the bills. Do not park here. You are blocking the door. Yes, you are. Limousine service. Looks like somebody's renting it out. Yeah, it's the limousine service place. That big, huge place. There we go. There's my shot. Okay. Let's see. Limousine service. So that's what it's being used for now. Reserved for limo employees. Do not park here. Look at that big stretch limo. There we go. Alright, cool. I'll have to come back and worry about getting this one. You can see the building looks nice. So I'm trying to stay out of the sun here. Lens wipe. Here's visitor parking. <laughs> Look at this. That's where you just never know what you're gonna find around here. Look. <laughs> Nothing. Never mind. I'm not gonna say anything. Well, obviously they got limousines in here, so respect that and not try to get in here. Don't want to try to even op open in doors or nothing like that. See, here's the old body shop. You see it. Okay. Well, it's not too tragic. There's another huge empty bay. Damn shame, man. You can't do nothing with these places, you know? I mean, yeah, you park some cars there, but there could be so much more done with it. Look at how humongous this is. I'd buy it if I had the money. Oh, wow. Look at that. That right there to the front, if you look through those next doors, you can see my wheels out there. Pretty cool. I like you. Yeah, man. You don't have to be all dirty and gritty and torn up, do they? Wow, it's huge. It's just all wasted. Let's see if I can't get down further and look. Look at this. See if I can't find a clean spot in the window. It's all sitting there wasted. Look at all that space. This is huge. Back lot. At least it's not all burned up and garbage everywhere, right? That's cool. Well, there's a busted window. I was gonna say, man, I'm surprised there's no busted windows yet. Put a piece of plexiglass in there, you can see that how it's bent right there. There's a busted out window there. Oh, never mind, here we go. Here's busted out windows. Got a piece of plexiglass. I can just push it out with my finger if I wanted to. <coughs> what are these? Oh, more for pest control. I don't want none of that. Yeah, pretty much the building, you know, it's huge. Yeah, I mean, it's huge. This is not no little car lot once upon a time. This is a 
big car lot. Here's the inside of the gates. Look at all this. Push, or pull, push to start and stop. Want me to do it? Should I, should I, should I? <laughs> Big side brick wall here. Yeah, that's gonna keep somebody out. Look at this. There's the sales up. There's one of the sales offices, I, I believe. Well, it's not a whole lot, but I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to walk out this way a little bit. Kind of walk, give you a shot of the whole building. And, uh, we're going to get on out of here. So once again, if you got any stories or comments or memories, feel free to leave them. I'd love to hear from you. I don't remember all the history of all these places. That's what makes uh, interacting with you guys so important. You know, it's, it's not about me, it's about us. I'll come out here and do the filming. I'll come out here and find the places and uh, you jump on in and if you got stories about them. You used to work here, you bought a car here. Uh, you just remember the place, whatever you got to say. I welcome all comments and I promise you that no matter what, no matter how big we get, I always remember my core fans, my core uh, subscribers, and your opinion will always matter to me, always. We'll never get too big for our britches on this channel, I promise you that. When I started off, I really didn't think about it, but as time's gone by, this channel is as much as yours as it is mine, because with your comments and your, uh, without you, the channel doesn't mean anything. It really doesn't. It means absolutely nothing. A little bob wire. You know, just because I'm going out and I'm filming them, I think that's my part of doing it for you. Your part, if you want to be part of this, what you are is to give me the stories, give me the back feed. Uh, I have a couple of subscribers. I got Gibby's wife and uh, J-Man and... Uh, quite a few others can't really think of them off the top of my head right now I'm sorry but they have so much to the channel by just telling me the history of it I don't really have the time to go look at all these things up now my brother's starting to get really much really really involved in it he does a lot of research he looks these places up and then he wants to go out and hit them I I see these places I go hit them and then I let you do the research sometimes and uh, Social Rec, he's another one, you know, he's, uh, he's a good guy, he's a longtime friend of mine, and he adds so much to the channel too, you know, but it's not about none of us, including myself, I set up and do the editing, I go out and do the filming, throw the gas in the car, put the batteries in the cameras, buy the equipment, I feel that that's my part. And I had no problem doing that. And I hope you guys uh, can take the time to subscribe. Leave your comments on all the videos you see that you like. Even if you don't, just add whatever you want to it. It makes a big difference to me. It matters to me. You matter to me. City of Gary matters to me. I love Gary, Indiana. I love the people of Gary, Indiana. But it's like any place in life. You're going to have 95% those who don't want nothing but the good stuff and you always have those five percent you'll always have that no matter what you'll always have five percent of people who just don't care so i'm gonna sign on out of here just say no you know what we're not gonna sign out of here yet we'll do the front of this building here's the address 7301 So we're right down uh, Route 20 here. Here's the front of the building. I didn't get to do that. I apologize. I got a little excited when I seen it and remembered that I haven't documented this yet. So Let's see 
it's over here. Alright, there's the hallways. Alright, going 15 minutes into it. I want to wrap it up. Here's the front of the building. Well, that's a good shot, huh? So you don't have to get inside there. There's just one over here. I don't remember what that. I think they may have been the sales office. I'm gonna go take a look through those windows, see what's happening. There's the front of it. Looks like it's huge, isn't it? Man, it's a shame for a prime, prime spot right here too. I mean, this is a money maker spot. Just letting it sit and go to waste. Look at this. There's the fence we were inside of. Video surveillance in use on these premises. Okay. Here's a long, cool wall. I remember this wall was really vibrant. They had it painted really nice. It looked like pillars, red pillars on it. It was all the way down. Bunch of parking spaces. Here's the, not really adjacent building, but one that's next to it, see what we can see here. Another pretty much empty in there. Windows are filthy from the inside, so I really can't get a good shot. Lock. Look at this brickwork. I know I say it all the time, but I just love it. I, I think the brickwork is where it's at, you know? What we got in here? <laughs> you never know, do you? Oh yeah, that's pretty crumbly. I can tell by the walls. Let's see if we can get another shot over here. So maybe better get on it. It's gonna start crumbling soon. This is how it starts. You know, you let it go right here. When it's in this kind of condition, you can do something. Once it gets so far gone, it costs you three, four times the money. It's just not worth messing with. All right. Hard to believe nobody would open a business here, isn't it? There's curtains drawn here. Like nobody can look inside there. Look at these old parking spots. There we go. Alright. Well, here's another big, huge car dealership. Used to be kind of gone and wasted now and uh, like I said we're at 7301 and if you remember what this place used to be please make sure you leave your comments I'm gonna just label it as the, uh, the big empty lot car lot until somebody tells me different once I know what it is if I don't find it before I post this video I'll make sure that I change it up okay Sounds fair? All right. Okay, well, I'm still seeing storm. Here's another little pop. Hope you guys are enjoying the videos. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, share it on uh, social media, all you want. I uh, really don't get into that. 
I um, just kind of throw it out there and just hope the world's going to catch on to it. Or at least, not the world, but people of Gary, people who used to live here, people who are curious about it. This is our city. I love Gary, Indiana. I'll always be here for her. It's like a friend who uh, you just, you know, you, you never forget about. And that's what Gary reminds me of. A lot of good people out here. It's just a shame that uh, some of the bad elements and some of the crooked people out here have to take advantage of it. Like we, you would do an elderly sick person. You take advantage of it. They rip you off. They steal from you. Abuse you. And then pack up and go on vacation somewhere. You know, like go fight for uh, the immigrants in Texas instead of worrying about your own backyard. Hint, hint. Anyway, I'm out of here. It's Just City Storm. We'll see you next pop, all right?